We are back, Cross County Senior High Boys versus Armorell Senior High Boys. Car number 24 is jumping for Armorell and Jackson Henderson for Cross County. And number zero, Elliot with the ball. The starting lineup for Cross County, number one, Caleb Boykin, number 25, Jackson Henderson. Number three, Trevor Van Houten. Number two, Torian Warren. And Trevor Van Houten with the steal. And number 22, Tristan Hammer. That is your starting lineup for Cross County. Jackson oh, Henderson. Jack Henderson. And Cross County strikes first. Caleb Blake is really good to see us. Oh, really? It's pushing that ball down there. Yeah. Oh, Morell's offense taking it slow. Number number 24 with the miss. Car. Car, number 24, Car with the miss. Out of bounds, Armorell's ball. Cross County Senior High Boys have two seniors, and that is Trevor Van Houten, number three, and number one, Caleb Flicken. Van Houten tries for trying for a second steal. Oh yeah. Cross County's defense is playing really aggressive. But then you know, and that was number three, Collison. With the three. <laughs> Kayla Boykin. Caleb Boykin up to the free throw line. Shooting two. Oh, and he hits both free throws. Looks like Cross County is going into a 3 2 defense. And Armorell is just passing that ball around. Fast motion, number three. Rebounded by Trevor Van Houten. Home number three, Hollison didn't think he was going to get that ball. <laughs> but good hustle. I thought Trevor Van Houten would be the point guard right now. Toy out war with the ball. Ooh. Oh. That would be bounce. really good defense by number uh -huh. 10. That's out of bounds, Cross County's ball.
Caleb Boykin, Wadi, 42. Oh my goodness, 42 is a big man. That is a big man. Sellers, number 42. Caleb Boyce is just taking this game over. I think Cross County needs to be a little bit more quicker on the weekend. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be hard to stop in this game. Oh, yes. Need to play some aggressive defense on number 42, Sellers. Oh, number one, Caleb Wicken with the three and shot is no good. Good shot selection, but he's couldn't connect. Oh, yeah. Rebounded by Tristan Henry. Pass to Caleb Wicken. They were just letting Caleb Wicken have the uh, baseline uh -huh. every time. And he's aggressive from the baseline. He can get a wide open three. He can pass him to the post. It's... Mm -hmm. Torian Torian Moore with a shot. Three. Is off. He can shoot the three. And number 42, Sellers, is getting that ball in. And he's just shooting it up I there. think he's going to have a big game. Oh, yeah. He seems like a key player to Armorell. <laughs> and the foul was on number 22, and, Tristan Hill. And defensive star, but angry, K. Block. Mm -hmm. Rebounded by Tristan Hill. I think Hammer. K. Block can hold number 42, Sellers. Oh, yeah. He's aggressive. He's... Strong. He's not afraid to have a little contact. Uh oh. He loves contact. And now Jason Anderson with the three. Almost got it. Uh -huh. Number 42 is just, he's just a monster Batman. That no look pass is beautiful. Uh, Grant, do you know what happened there, buddy? Um, I think he stepped in carry. Uh, Not for sure, though. It's a turn Traveling violation. Oh, uh, I didn't see it, but that's what the rest called. Number zero freshman, Jeffrey Pierce, a right, sophomore, will be checking in. For Jackson Henderson. Jeffrey Pierce really good on the mid-range shot. Yeah. He can do some work in the post. He don't like to, but he will shoot the three ball. He's good at it. Mm -hmm. Oh, Armorello is just passing I feel like the Jeffrey, ball. Can, Jeffrey Pierce can hold Sellers. Uh huh. Both kind of body style. Jeffrey's a little bit small, uh, shorter. Oh. Right there, they, you're they just looking. Get, they need to get a body on him. Uh huh. Someone needs to box up right there. They need to get a body on him. Uh huh. That's just a big. He's too big of a boy to not. Time out. Cross County. We'll Thirty seconds.
And we are back, number 42, Sellers, to the free throw line. And he makes the first one. Sellers is having a good night right now. It looks like he's almost scored all of Armorell's points. He splits the free throws half. Okay, blah with the rebound. Good catch on Tristan Henry. Uh -huh. Push. Jackson Henderson in for Tristan Hammer. Caleb working with the ball. Oh! You got Caleb working. You got a little frustrated when you got ripped. Uh huh. Number 44 is in. Lawrence. Uh, yeah, Lawrence. Checked in for Sellers, number 42. Ward, he can jump. Uh huh. For sure. That, if that was a foul on him, that was an all ball. Mm -hmm. He just held him from shooting it. That... Elliot to the line. He makes the first shot. And he makes both. Turn around one inbounding. Armrell's not pressing like all the other games they did. No, they are not. Oh. Willie K. Bly lost his bounce right there and had to step out of bounds. Bounds? Bounce. Okay. <laughs> you know what I mean, Grant. Jeffrey Pierce and I'm reporting for Lawrence and going at it in the post. Mm -hmm. Oh, I believe that was tipped by Tori on the wall. The two sophomores in the game, Jeffrey Pierce and Tori on one. We have two juniors, Kay Blah, Jack Smith, and one senior, Caleb Wickham. Jimmy Pierce standing his ground. Good defense. Mm -hmm. Cross County's defense it looks like it's moving. Looks like Armorell is trying to take the last shot of the quarter. Car with the ball. Oh. oh! And number three, Halsey with the three. Shot and number two, turn on one. I the, think he actually had fingers on it. Uh -huh. If I'm not mistaken, he just he powered it through and banked uh, it. I believe that was luck, but that's the end of the first quarter. 15 6, on the roll up.
And we are back to start the second quarter. 15-6, Armorell. Armorell has the ball at the beginning of the second quarter. It should be cross Kane's ball right now. Oh, really? Oh, you're right. Yeah. Wait. It should be cross Kane's ball. Because they got tip off. Oh, well. Oh, good save by Torion Warren. Van Houten with the floater a little bit. Oh, and Jackson Kane, or Jackson Henderson with the rebound and put back up. <coughs> it looks like Armorello is just getting these second chance points. That should be Cross County's ball. And it is. Checked in for the game, Cortavius Williams for Torian Warren. Tristan Hamrick. Number 24 car with the bucket. He is really tall, he can shoot, he can drive. He's good. That'll be a foul on 44. Right now, I'm 42, so yeah. Corte was with the ball, passed to Caleb Boykin, Tristan Hamrick, Jackson Henderson with the triple. Foul. On number 22, Tristan Hammer. Blocking foul. Blocking foul. He seems confused about the foul. I mean, you know, Jeffrey Pierce checking in. Checked in for the game, Jeffrey Pierce. And number 44 was wide open for the put, put up, for the layup. Looks like Cross County to man defense. Number zero, Elliott, guarded by Cortavius Williams. Yeah. 
boy on Ward is checking for the game. For Caleb Boykin. Number 44, Lawrence. Jackson, you seem trying to give Jeff Perry some support, but left his man open. But David Swing, good point guard. Five seven two is off. Toy out rebound by Toy out Warren. He wanted to shoot the three, but didn't want to. Toy out Warren with the ball, right wing. At this point, this is a timeout. I believe 30 seconds, cross county. We're back. Hey, coaches for this game. Tony Jones, jo assistant coaches, Jordan Weaver, and Big Country. <laughs> what has just happened? I believe it was on number one, Harris. And one. Jack Harrison with the and one. Oh, yes. Jack Harrison, phenomenal in the post. He's going to and shoot the ball. That was a foul on number 44, Lawrence. Jackson Henderson has eight points in this game so far. The lead is 21 14 Armour up. Oh. Torian being a little bit jumpy right there. Take over. Checking in for the game, Caleb Boykin. In for number three, Trevor Van Houten. Mm -hmm. Caleb Boykin, point guard. Oh. Caleb Boykin's gonna take that for himself. Yeah, wide open. Oh. Jeffrey Cross with the ball. Rebound. Uh, Ford Carr got up and got the rebound. Good move, but can't finish. Can't, gets the foul. Shooting two for Armour is Carr. And 
Carr misses both free throws. Caleb Wooden takes a Tory on one. Good screen by Jimmy Pierce. Oh, for Darius Williams, it's step back by air balls. Oh, out of bounds. Go across the his ball. Checking in for the game. Davis for Lawrence. And Cave Lion for Williams. These second chance buckets are good for cross county right now. As a foul, I believe by Jackson Henderson. Good defense by Jackson, I guess they just throw it off out. Mm -hmm. I didn't throw it off. Number 40, Davis to the free throw line. Davis makes the first free throw. And Davis with both free throws connecting. The score is now 23-16 Cross County. Or, excuse me, Armorell. Found Armorell is number zero, Elliot. I'll play at cross county in the bonus. Okay, Bob with the shot, but this is straight that would be one on one. Oh! Well, we found K. Bly. Number one, Harris to the free throw line. Checking into the game. Number 22, Tristan Hammert for. Jeffrey Pierce. Good free throw shot by number one, Harris. Cave Lush checked out, checking in for him is Trevor Van Houten. That would be over the back, mm. hard. Splitting the free throws. Harris will be. Right now. That'll put Jack Peterson at the free throw line, cross county in the bonus. Yes, they are. With two minutes and 15 seconds remaining until halftime. Timeout on the court. Timeout on the rail. This will be. A 30 second timeout. We're back after that 30 second timeout. We actually have to play for a while.
Jackson Henderson makes the first free throw. And he connects on both. Oh! And Jackson Henderson backs into Caleb Wicker. In other news, Grant, did you hear about Kevin Durant and DeMarcus Cousins being ejected from the le from the game the other night? No, I did not. I know Stephen Curry, star, mm -hmm. is hurt. He'll be back, is what he says. And number one, number one, Harris. With the mic. Jack Henderson. Oh, hard foul. Jackson Henderson to the line. Checking in for the game. Victoria oh, Warren, sophomore, is out. But being checked in by another sophomore, Jake Reed. It'll be his first time entering the game. So, in the game we had Thurman Houghton, Jake Reed, Caleb Wicken, Jack Henderson, and Tristan Hill. They're still in a man defense. Ooh. This man defense is really working out for him, actually. Oh, I don't even. Oh, I don't really, think really hmm. good defense. Oh yeah, I don't even think Hollison seen that pass coming to him. Cross oh, County is down. See why he's still sitting down. He's like, Lever, Lever, what's his name? Sellers. Sellers. Oh. Uh -oh. oh. Really good move by Carl. Caleb Boykin driving down the court. Pushing up, pushing up the floor. Oh. This memory shot. Uh oh. Jake Reed gets the defense. Oh. Oh. It was going to hit double digits. Cross count is down 10, 30, 20. Cross count just wait and take the last shot. Maybe. Try to go two for one. Jackson Henderson with the move. Good move. Mm -hmm. Jackson Henderson, I believe that. If I'm not mistaken, he might have won. Probably. Right now. <laughs> well, yeah, that's a, that will be in the first half. Armor at 30. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I believe there's a foul, one and one. Thanks for correcting me, Jared. Number three, Hollison to the free throw line. Actually, it looks like he's hurt. He, he's, he just got knocked down. He wanted the foul, so he flopped, I think. Yeah. I think he should be, should be shooting, too. Free throws will be shot. Mm -hmm. There shouldn't be much time left on the clock. They put 1.5 seconds left on the clock. So, Cross County will probably stay at 22 points. First shot is up and it is good. That makes the score 31 on Morrell, 22 cross county. And he goes two for two from the line. Yes, he does. 
Oh, oh goodness. Oh, I thought he was about to make that. So that concludes the first half. Armorell, 32, cross.
And we are back. We're back. In for the game for Cross County. Number one, Caleb Boykin, and number three, Trevor Van Houten. The two seniors. And the two juniors, Jackson Henderson and Tristan Hamrick, and the sophomore, Torian Wood. We're currently down by 10. Rebounded. I believe that's a foul. Looks like Trevor Van Houten is running the point guard position. Caleb Wiggins running the shooting guard. And Torian Ward and Tristan Hamrick are running the forwards. And Jackson Henry is running the post. How are you for sure? Well, Trevor Van Houten usually brings the ball down the court. And as you can tell, a point guard brings it down. And Caleb Wiggins is the most deadly shooter they got. I don't know about that. Oh, bad pass. Well, not bad pass. But. Oh, he missed the layup. Sacked in a full second four. Oh, and number 42, Sellers. He finally back. gets put back in the game. This is ironic. He's been doing a good game. I believe almost every time he's been put in, he's been making it. That would be a timeout, full timeout, cross county. Cortavius Williams has been checked into the game, so has Cortavius Williams, and so has Cade Lock. Oh, oh, goodness. Cade Block and Jackson Henderson run into each other. Imagine they didn't feel it, they both part of it. <laughs> oh! Cross County's ball. Screaming by Tristan Hamrick. Oh, that was a beautiful pass. And Sellers go down hard. Blah. 
deep three, air ball. That's Stephen Curry range. Number 10 for a three and a miss. Oh. That would be off Caleb Wilson's chest. Hey, Coach Jones is furious about it. Tillman has been checked out of the game. And it's stolen by Quatavis Williams. Oh! But Carr got it back for him. Uh, Elliott with the ball. Elliott for the three. And a miss. Carr with the rebound, put back, and a miss. It looks like words are being spoken between 24 car and 22 hammer. Mm. Caleb oh. Boykin drives in. Great. That was good. great offense. Good pass by Jackson Anderson. Oh, yes. That's what you call great court vision. Cross County is playing that man defense. And it's stolen. Oh, no. I take that back. Three. He's used to three again and misses. Mm. Rebounded by Tristan Hamrick. Passes to Cortez Williams taking the ball down the court. Oh, answer. Thanks for the this is the ball. Checking in for the game, Trevor Van Houten for Sebastian Mitchell. Coach Jones is seeing aggravated right now. And that is a timeout by Armorell. Full timeout. I just, I just can't wait till Junior Hunter Light comes back. Mm -hmm. He's that. Wonder, he has a little tear in his meniscus, I believe. I think he'll be back Friday against the Desert Eagles. Mm. We'll be back. Back. Armorell has the ball. The score is 36 24, third quarter with four minutes and 40 seconds remaining. Armorell is up. Oh, and a foul. Still, this is uh, the crowd cheering for their own team's traveling violation. Oh. That has been an up and down. I thought it was a foul myself. Screen set. Take that book and did not take it. Sure, Van Houten. And he misses. Didn't set his feet at all. He just did it up. Cortavis Williams with the hustle, got the ball stolen. Cortavis Williams, oh, he should have pulled up. And Carl, and Carl with the lay in. Oh, Caleb looking at the layup and miss. Oh, that's a charge. Good stuff. Tristan Hammer with the charging foul. Basket does not count. That was amazing. He said his feet. He said his feet right. Beautiful. Oh. 
Checking in for the game, Tony on Warren for Caleb Boykin. Sure, Ben Howes just drives in, but this is the layup. Well, Davis could have had still been paying attention to the ball. Never been out in defensive star. Should be. Oh, no way. I don't know what they need to do about number 24 cars. I don't he's know. He's big, he's quick, he drives and just lay it up every time. Yeah. Here with number 42. I believe it was a bad pass for Trevor Van Houten. Check it in for the game, Caleb Boykin. Elliot has the ball. I do not think that was a foul at all. He just went. I think that number one made contact with Cortavius. Cortavius didn't really mess with him. Mm -hmm. Violation by number 42, Sellers. Forty to twenty-four, third quarter with two minutes and twenty-five seconds left remaining in the third quarter. Armorella is up. Cortavius Williams didn't get the foul down there on their end. No idea. With the 44 foul. Lawrence takes in for 24 cars. Yes. Jack Reed checks in for Cortavius Williams. Well, Grant, in this situation, what would you do as Coach Jones? Well, You're in Coach Jones' shoes. Man, defense has been kind of working. But I just think I might change it just to see what else you can do. Let me play a man zone. Maybe. Because they can shoot, but they're not really trying to shoot. I'm real. They can just take it slow a little bit. Yeah. I remember playing basketball in my, day, my days. We had... We had two people playing man and three people playing a zone. Like a triangle defense. Getting these second chance buckets. And this is Hill across county. Oh Jackson Henderson. Tristan Henry 
made a charge. I think he's just a, one of the best cross county pick, one of the best cross county men to make a charge. Thirty seconds remaining in the third quarter. That was a bad pass for Caleb Boykin. Jake Reed down there. Oh my goodness! And Caleb Boykin came up right behind him, right behind Ellen, and just swatted that ball. He reminded me of LeBron James when he beat him on that. And Trevor Howell with the steal, pushing the ball down the court. It's Trevor Howell. Oh. And Ellie says, I'm going to get my block back. And he blocks number three, Trevor Van Houten. And Jackson Henderson makes it. Ellie drives in. And he misses. And that will be. And we'll be. Back. Over, the score right now is on rail 46, cross county 28. Uh, this ain't looking, but this ain't looking really good for cross county. No, it is not. Oh, blocking foul number 42, Sellers. Trevor Van Houten, pull up. Trevin Houghton to the line. Oh, good rebound. Yeah, no. Number three. Oh, oh, almost connected with the. Jackson Henderson to the line. And he makes it. Oh! 
I guess they for, I guess Armero forgot to rebound. <laughs> oh. Cross County's ball. Trevor Houghton with the shot. Oh, oh that is lit. Trevor Van Houghton for the three and a mate. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And Caleb Boykin. The ball went through the legs of Caleb Boykin. Uh -huh. And he can't connect. Oh! Oh no! And the Armorell fans are not liking that charge. We got about three of them standing up. They, are, they did not like that. They did not like that call. Four to four with the steal. Four to four is also Lawrence. Trevor Van Houten with the ball. Tipped by Tristan Hammer. And Tristan Hammer with the rebound and put a oh rebound again. He's just a beast down there. Tristan Hammer to the line, shooting free throws. Timeout. Timeout, Armorell. This will be a, I believe, a third. And we're back, Tristan Hammer to the line. And he misses the first free throw attempt. And he makes it for the second one. Tristan Harry has split the free throw tips. Armorell's just passing the ball right now. And number three, Collison with the shot. Caleb Wigan driving down the court. Oh, and that's a charge. I'm still a good one. Cross County is using the press defense, press coverage defense. Oh, and Alvarez fans are getting heated down there. Stolen by Cortavis Williams. Oh, that's a foul. Oh, apparently that was a charge. Oh, words are being spoken. Number one, Caleb Boykin, and number three for Armorell. Hmm. Caleb Boykin needs to calm down. Number three is talking stuff, I think. Mm. That's not good. Caleb Boykin is a big asset to Cross County's offense and defense. It'll be a major upset. 
they lose them. Just because of rejection. I believe the foul is on number 12, Cortavius Williams. Number one, Harris makes the first free throw attempt. He gets another one. And the Swiss and free throws. Almarillo gets the ball back for a jump ball. Another foul on the cross county is number 12 for Tavis Williams. Man. Poor Tavis Williams is getting checked out. Jake Reed will be checking in. Mm -hmm. Poor Tavis needs to watch it. I don't see why they haven't put in cross county as number 21 K Block. Mm -hmm. He hasn't been in in a while. Or Tori Warren or Jeffrey Pierce. Oh, yeah. I haven't seen them in a game. I don't think they're in foul trouble. Servant <laughs> out with the ball. Looking good shot, but just couldn't connect. Trevor went out next to floor. Oh, good pass by Caleb Boykin. Mm -hmm. Jackson Henderson. They didn't even want to guard him, I guess. It was oh, wide yeah. open. That would oh, be yeah. timeout Cross County. Oh, yeah. That timeout would be... Hold timeout. Full timeout. We'll be back. I believe after this game, the Desert Eagles will be coming here at Cross County. It'll be a four-game night. Junior high girls, junior high boys, senior high girls, and senior high boys will all be playing Friday night. Number three to the line. Okay, okay. Caleb Lake at number one with the foul. Yeah. To me, it looks like number three and number one are like, have bad blood because I've seen them exchanging words and I've seen them just pushing each other around and talking. Why, oh, free throw would not count. He will step over the line. Mm. And that was Lawrence, I believe, who done that. 
Cross gonna be in a man zone. Mm -hmm. If anybody don't know what that means, it means they play man, but it's like they don't leave their zone. I think Cross County defense is doing pretty good. Oh yeah. I think Old Rose is trying to waste time. Why? Man. No effort at all. My goodness. Harris with the lay in. Uh, number three looking for the charge with a teammate. Whoa. Caleb Wiggins should be in foul trouble. Mm -hmm. I think he's just, I think Caleb Wiggins is telling Coach Jones that he did nothing to number one, I believe. But Caleb Wiggins going to take a seat. Kay Bly will check in. Mm -hmm. And the first free throw is off. out with the rebound and second chance point. He said foul. He said foul. Yes. Coach Jones has said foul. Did he, Stuggy? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. A positive. Yes. Good job, Al. Did you not hear him? Grant. He said foul. I believe the foul is on Trevor Van Houten. <clears throat> Elliot is at the free throw line. Out of all of the people they decide to foul, they foul Elliot. of getting heated. And, it, and that is a tech. And they have called a tech on cable.
was a show. I knew it was going to happen, but I thought Man. Things got hit real quick. We actually think we caught, caught this. And Elliot just holding the ball. And as you can see on the run, he knows they got this game on their hands. Hey, Troy on Troy on one clapping with on the run. Ron came, Troy on. And what is he doing? Corey on one. Corey on. He's cramping up the armor on crowd. This is not good. Why, why are they clapping, Regis? This is something else. I, why are they clapping? Why, are, why is our side clapping? I have no idea. I hope they realize. What is happening? This is crazy. I, well, I guess Arnell is just going to hold the ball. And Cross is going to let him. Elliot, Elliot, I believe, he has put on a show tonight. And so is Sellers, number 42. This game has ended. 30 seconds remaining. Arnell has won 59. 39. Oh, and Cross County is about to play some defense. Here we go. And I cannot see the action. Armorell's crowd is standing in front of me. And Armorell's just going to hold this game. And Armorell has taken this game. 59 39. Come back next, next time, Friday night, it'll be Cross County. Versus Desert for all four teams we playing that night.